Are you an investor looking for premium market opportunities? Presenting premium and exclusive service for investors by Calcon. The United States is facing increasing recession fears as the Federal Reserve, the country's central bank, stays bullish in combating high inflation. And Jeff Bezos, the founder of Amazon and the multi-billionaire, recently urged consumers and firms to consider delaying big expenditures during the holidays since an economic recession may be on the horizon. In an interview with CNN, the business tycoon advised customers to keep their money secure and refrain from needless expenditures in the upcoming months. He urged American households to avoid major purchases like brand new cars and televisions because the US is staring at a recession. The US Energy Information Administration expects low inventories of distillate fuels, primarily consumed as diesel fuel and heating oil, will lead to high prices through early 2023. According to the EIA's November short-term energy outlook, diesel prices will remain higher than $5 per gallon the rest of the year and bills for homes that use heating oil will increase by 45% this winter season compared with last winter. According to the EIA, US inventories of distillate fuels finished October at their lowest levels in any October since 1951. In the week ending November 11th, distillate fuel inventories increased by 1.1 million barrels and are about 15% below the five-year average for this time of the year, the EIA said in its weekly inventory report released on the 16th of November. Distillate fuel production decreased last week, averaging 5.1 million barrels per day. And commenting upon it, EIA Administrator Joe De Carolis said inventories are just one part of the supply equation for diesel and other distillates. The distillate fuels in storage aren't the only source of diesel. They have to keep trucks and trains moving, but lower than average storage levels will contribute to higher costs for diesel and for heating fuels through the winter. Energy Information Administration expects additional uncertainty in the global marketplace for distillates and other fuels as the European Union plans to ban imports of petroleum products from Russia in early 2023. Since the pandemic is extremely low diesel inventories have been introduced, reducing refining ability have also increased diesel costs in the US to a record high premium above the gasoline and crude oil. And with the EU imposing import restrictions on Russian crude from December and on refined petroleum products, starting in February, the supply of diesel in the United States and throughout the world is expected to become even more constrained in the future. Well, with that, we come to the end of this video. Do let us know your thoughts in the comment section and don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button and press that bell for notifications on our upcoming videos. Thanks for watching Sage for Kalkai Media.